Welcome back to Cleveland on the Rocks, Alive in Burn Bar, and I'm Matt, and that's Roger, and Roger's got a super cool bottle, a Jack Daniels Bottled and Bond Traveler's Exclusive. Yes, he does. Welcome back, guys. We got our bottle of Jack Daniels here. Because Roger was like, man, I got Jack Daniels bottled in bond. 100 proof sour mash whiskey. And you know what? Where'd you get this bottle from, Roger? Because I've never seen this in a box before. And you have super cool stuff in boxes. So I feel like people want to know where you got this from. You, you love my boxes, don't you? I do. You got a lot of cool boxes, man. That's what it is. He got a whole shelf of boxes, bro. Like, it's crazy. So this was a uh, another gift given to me by somebody because people just know how I feel about my Jack Daniels. Damn. Um, this one was actually picked up at the uh, the border of Canada. So Hell yeah! Any any port of entry generally will sell these at the uh, what do they call them? The exempt, commissary stores. Yeah, whatever you want to call those, the tax mm -hmm. exempt stores or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, or if you're traveling in uh, airplanes and stuff like that, when you land at the airports, their liquor they stores generally us. have them there. Hell yeah! So that's super cool. So, and this one, dude, and their boxes open super cool too. It's not like even a normal opening box. Like it all crushes down like super easy in this. And then you got your bottle. And see, I've seen this bottle before, but I've never seen it in this shape before, honestly. But I'm assuming it's gotta be the same thing, probably. Gotta be because it's is Canadian. This a, is this a single barrel? Do you know? Uh, I don't think it's single barrel. These ones I believe are just, uh, they're different just, proof. They're proofed only in and it's bottled in bond, so it has yeah. to be 100 proof. Yes. Okay, I get it. And I mean, all you guys that know what bottled in bond means, it all, this is really cool. So there's a lot of really cool stuff. I don't know that you can see it all on the label here. Reading it's gonna take way too long and you guys aren't gonna watch the whole video. Um, very, very cool bottle, very cool packaging here. Um, obviously your 100 proof bottle. Roger, I'm gonna let you open this one again. This isn't my bottle, so I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let Roger go with this. Is this a screw off one? That's yeah, just a screw off. What? It's not all fancy like my other ones with the wood. Damn, what's Pressing. going on? They must they slacked on this one. Does that smell like Jack Daniels? That smells a little more like Jack Daniels. That smells like Jack Daniels. I'm getting ready to put some banana. I'm on it. That's killer. Really cool, cool bottle, man. So Jack Daniels has all kinds of really, really cool stuff. And I know a lot of people either love or hate Jack 7. And they're like, you know what? It's all right. Just set it up. Yeah, I'll just leave that anywhere. We'll get it. Right? <laughs> yeah. You can hear yeah. I'll, I'll cut that part. <laughs> no, leave it in. <laughs> we can't. We can't. So, obviously, we don't have the we don't have the top to put back on it. It flew on the ground over there. But that's okay. I guess we got to drink it all then. That, I mean, <laughs> I don't know about that. I got to work tomorrow, but that's that's what it is. <laughs> Honestly, this smells like Jack Daniels, like Jack but like it almost smells heightened up a little bit. Like it almost gets your nose hairs a little hotter than normal because I know Jack Daniels is usually what eighty. And Generally, this, yeah. this yep. is a hundred, so this is a little bit stronger on the ethanol here. You still get that banana kick in it. It's like a banana bread. Pepper too. But yeah, get that peppery, definitely. peppery smell to it. Yeah, this dude smells super it? good. I am definitely. Cheers, cheers to you guys out there. Oh wow. Definitely, okay. Definitely smoother. It is. It almost hits you with rye in the middle of your tongue. Finishes off. Uh, with the heat and the Kentucky hug catching you right in the back and it walks it right down to your stomach. Um, gives you like a little warmth back there, which is not a bad thing. Um, it gives you that normal Jack Daniels that you're used to with the little kick on top. Um, the banana comes further afterwards as you're talking yeah. through the back yep. of it. I didn't catch it until all of a sudden it hit my stomach and I'm like, I get a banana kick and that's what I was looking for. Um, that's the staple to me of Jack Daniels is that, app, that banana bread flavor that it gets you I like it. I feel like this is fantastic too. I need more of it. You, you do need, well, the bottle's open. Go for it, right? <laughs> like, it's right there. Honestly, Jack Daniels bottle and bond, this is fantastic. I would definitely, how much does this bottle run you? You know, I don't know. I got it as a gift, but uh, I think I'm taking a trip to Canada uh, Labor Day weekend, so I'll probably pick up another bottle because this will be gone before then. Guaranteed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, good. Is, it's good. This is actually way better than Jack 7. Honestly, in my my opinion, and uh, I'm not the biggest fan of Jack Seven, but I'll tell you what, the flavors of Jack and that, not even flavors because they don't have flavors to it. The different bottles of Jack Daniels that Roger has, I feel like are all fantastic. Have you had the Sour Mash Green Label yet? You know what? 
I've got one that's unopened we can try. You do have I, that? I do. I, I saw one online actually yesterday. That's why I was like, I'm gonna name this to him in the video. We do that tomorrow and that's gonna be cool. I've never had it before. I've seen it. Really cool looking bottle. This one, dude, this is really good. Honestly, I, I couldn't imagine this costing more than, I would say probably 70 bucks-ish. For Jack Daniels, this is like a topper. This is one that would be like a way above the Jack 7, you know, the $30 bottle at the store. I would think it's good. So to me, I would pay seventy bucks for this, seventy-five bucks for this. I don't know how much this is. If I do find out the price, I'll put it right down here in the video. I'll drop it right there. Um, I really don't know what it is. I'll look it up after we're done here in North. Well, yeah, right shoot me a message with it. I'll put it down here for all the people down here. They'll see how much this is. This is really cool. Um, the other thing that comes with these bottles that when when he gets these bottles, he has these in crazy weird boxes. I've not. I've seen a bottle of this, but not. it didn't look this tall. I'm, I'm thinking it was a shorter one. I don't know, though. I might have been wrong. But they all come in these really cool boxes that he has in this glass display case that looks freaking awesome. And there's all kinds of crazy Jack boxes in with the Jack bottles in them, like looking super cool. I've, I've never even seen these boxes before. I think this is really awesome. I think uh, you've also said that, too, about my single barrel. You've never seen that. You haven't seen that bottle in a long time. I have I have one. I have the Ohio Select one. Yes. They they saved that one for me. Yes. And I have another one here, the normal store one. I have two of those, but I I did get one in a box, and the only reason I got that was because Ohio did six barrels, and they were single barrel ones. So I had they had six barrels. It was one through six. I have barrel five because barrel five had less bottles than the other ones. So I wanted that one because if you you know less people would have it. So I wanted that one because I want the weird bottles that nobody else has. That's kind of what I go for. But yeah, those are those are really cool too. I think I would have picked it just because number five is my lucky number. That was my baseball See? number throughout high school and mine was two little league and everything. So and I was like, damn, I can get the Derek Jeter number. Oh, Let me get Jeter. two. You're like I'm right there. I'm the biggest Jeter fan ever, dude. I wear the Jeter fans when that when playoffs time comes. You'll see me in my Jeter jersey. We're doing it, and we live in Cleveland. I get it. But look, Derek Jeter is my favorite player. That's what it is. It is what it is. Everybody got their thing. That's that's my thing. I like Derek Jeter is the man. So either way, we're way off topic at this point. So. <laughs> Jack Daniels Bottled and Bond. This one's 100 proof. You can get this at the airport liquor stores, the stores that can take you overseas. All the, the different ones that none of us go on. You ever go out of the country, you can probably find one of these at the airport. If you guys are out at the bar with your friends, you guys are doing your thing, have a good old time. Make sure you're not drinking and driving. Call an Uber. Get home safe. People love you. Do that. Make sure while you're doing that and you're in the back of that Uber. And you're kind of lit a little bit. You're like, you know what? I saw this on Matt's video. That's super cool. Let me make sure I go on there and like, share, subscribe on it. YouTube, Facebook, TikTok. The other one that I don't remember, Instagram. All them things. Catch them all. Do it big. And hopefully you're drinking something super cool like us that not everybody has. So thank you for bringing this, Roger. I appreciate you, brother. Anytime, buddy. We'll see you guys next time.